upgrade your smartphone with Appalachian Wireless, get $300 off selected models. Capture memories, stream, and stay connected with the latest technology. Visit one of our stores or AppalachianWireless.com right now. The city of Pikeville has recently adopted a new ordinance that is aiming to increase tourism and bring more restaurants downtown. The hotel and restaurant incentive package is one way the city is campaigning for both types of establishments to grow in numbers. If successful, the city's economy could greatly benefit. We uh, know with our growing tourism industry that we have here, with the, with the arena scheduling the concerts, the conferences and conventions that they do, that we need more beds in the city of Pikeville uh, to host those type of events. So one of the things that the commission thought was important was to incentivize some of those hotel chains to look at Pikeville a little more aggressively than maybe they had done in the past. We're also doing that with restaurants, uh, people that um, um, obviously, the city of Pikeville needs, we'd like to have some more restaurants. And one of the ways to do that is to incentivize those companies or business owners to come in and, and look at Pikeville a little more aggressively than they would have before. So some of those incentives would include a rent subsidy, some facade improvements, signage grants that would, would help them with establishing a, a location in the city limits of Pikeville. Pikeville City officials are placing their focus on continued growth for the downtown area. More hotels and restaurants could allow for bigger events to take place in Pikeville. We have seen such a such a growth in the city uh, the last few years, especially with the growth of the medical center, or with the growth of the University of Pikeville, and certainly our community is growing. We um, have grown in population, which is really exciting for Forest Town in Eastern Kentucky. So we want to be able to provide all the opportunities that we can for our visitors to come in, places to stay, places to eat, but also for our community members. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Nick Collum.